mining asteroid is packed with Caribbean fuel. That's where I should start the explosion. But how am I gonna get over there? Got it. I could have had a better life. I could have died happy. But you just had to come along, didn't you? Why me? What did I do to deserve this? I guess it doesn't matter in the end. This will all be over soon. All I've got to do is crank up the energy levels and shoot. Hmm. Ironic that ending this should be so easy after the hell I've been through. Well, here goes. Perez, Ritter, Nathan, Eno, I'm coming. Connor! I won't fall for your hallucinations again. Connor, help! Please! It's not Eno. Eno's dead. I need help. I'm injured. I'm losing a lot of blood. Can you hear me? Her signal's coming from the Ark of Truth. Good God. Hold on! I... I can't stop the bleeding! These Unovian machines can help you. Come on, hold on to me. Uh, everything's going dark. We're almost there. Just stay with me, okay? Don't give in. Not yet. Catalog specimen is entered. Beginning healing process. Of course. The Ark's teleportation system must have retrieved you when you got injured. It recognizes you because you touched that machine earlier. <coughs> I can't! I can't! No! Come on, come on, you can make it! You've gone through so much more! Don't give up on me now! I can't breathe! Don't let- don't let it take me! I don't want to die! You're gonna be fine! Just hold on! Please stay with me! Please! 
Eno? It's gonna be alright. Don't worry. Everything's gonna be alright. Specimen stabilized. Vital signs returning to normal. Healing process successful. You're gonna live, Eno. We can still get out of here. We can think of something. It's not too late. Warning. Corruption detected. No. No corruption detected in specimen. Then where... Scan initializing. Corruption detected in new specimen. The Ark of Truth recognizes this specimen as the human named Connor. Analyzing. Pocket corruption detected in human Connor cerebral cortex. Corruption source recognized. Level 1 mind quality. Contact with host 2327 by human calendar. Of course. Just when I think I might have a chance, you prove yourself to be one step ahead of me. You can't ever let me have a LITTLE BIT OF HOPE! Hey, hey, I'm not dead. No. No, you're not. What happened? I remember Ward shooting me and then falling and then I was here. The Ark of Truth's teleportation network saw you were injured and teleported you to its med bay. Really? Guess I'm lucky I touched that device earlier. <laughs> yeah, yeah you are. I heard you calling for me over the comm. I didn't think you would show up. I was delirious. I didn't know what I was doing. And it was also pretty lucky I heard you when I did. Because I was just about to blow up the whole colony. What? Why? I, uh... I thought you were dead. I gave up. I just wanted to put an end to this. I see. Well, I'm flattered that I mean so much to you. It turns out I'm not dead. So we can find a way to escape without committing suicide. Eno, there is no escape for me. Hey, what did I just say? No giving up! I found the mind. Really? Where is he? He's inside me. What? Part of him, anyway. That's why I've been so angry and depressed all the time. He's twisting me into someone I'm not. That's how he keeps coming back. He put part of himself inside me when we first met. Wherever I go, he goes. And from me, he recovers and spreads again. That's why I can't leave. The only way he'll be completely defeated is if the part of him inside me is defeated too. I have to die. No! There's got to be another way! There isn't. There just... isn't. This is what it's come down to. And it fits so perfectly. It's the only way it can be. But it's not over for you yet. You can still get out of here. You still have a chance. And I'm supposed to leave and live my life all sunshine and daisies while you stay here and die? Yes. No way! You've still got so much to do. You have that chance. Please take it. So do you. You can't just resign yourself to this. You've got your whole life ahead of you. <laughs> I'm 70. I'm an old man, remember? Please don't give in. There's so much more than this. Not for me, there isn't. Freeze! Don't move! Commander, we found two survivors inside the alien vessel. One of them is Connor. Excellent. I'm on my way. Hold them. So you're taking us alive now? Orders are orders. Now shut up or I'll have to shoot somewhere that hurts. Finally, do you know how hard it is to track you down? Ward! Good God, you're alive! 
What do you want from us, Adara? It's simple. That big, unkillable corrupted just stole one of our escape pods and took it to the planet below. Something's going on here, and I haven't the faintest idea what it is, but I think you do. So I've got a few questions, and you're going to answer. You still gonna kill us? I'm afraid I still have to, yes. Then fuck you! And you too, Ward! Why would we help you? Adara just wants to stop this. Same as you. And you? Why haven't they killed you yet? Because I was the head of this colony. I know things. I'm valuable. And you've been exposed like us. Actually, it turns out I was wrong about my exposure theory. We scanned Ward here, and it's obvious he isn't afflicted with an infection. Then why kill us? Because you're after the destruction of this facility. I have to defend it at all costs. I'd ask you to change your mind, but I'm pretty sure what your answer will be. So before I remove you, I need to know everything you know. About the infection, about the aliens, all of it. Well, forget about it. You clowns will just mess everything up and he'll come back again. Trust me. This is your last chance. You have to choose. Listen to me, forget about saving the colony, and make sure this never happens again, or let everything spiral out of control and doom humanity to certain extinction. Your call. You're crazy. I was afraid you'd say that. Adara, I'm afraid you've forgotten the most important rule about dealing with the corrupted. And what's that? Always know where they are. Look! Let's go! Damn it! Retreat! Back to the Aeon! Over here! Where are we going? To the hangar! We should be safe there for a little while. Hey, didn't you die? Word's gonna have to try harder than that to bring me down. It's my ship. Yeah, I think Adara's men have been patching it up. The hyperdrive is still out of order, but I think it can go sublight again. Might be worth something. Yeah, it might be worth everything. We can use it to get to the planet. That hunk of rock? Why in space would we do that? Because that's where that big, unkillable, corrupted went. Something's down there. Something very big, very important. I've got to find out what. It may be the key to stopping the mind. Think about this, man. This ship could be our last chance for getting out of here. If we take it down there, there's a chance it may not ever fly again. I know. And that's why I have to ask you both to choose. Choose what? Warren, the mind is inside me. I can't leave, and I don't trust Adara to be able to put a stop to this. I have to be the one to finish him. Whoa. What do you mean inside you? It's a long story, but he means what he says. He's dead set on taking the mind out once and for all. It's not a matter of choice for me. Ever since I met the mind, I was destined to do this. Our fates are tied together, and the only way I can ever make sure he never comes back is if I die. The two of you? You don't have to die too. You still have a chance to escape. Adara took Ward alive. She may not kill you too. She's just after me because I need to blow up the colony. But if you come with me, you'll be throwing away that chance. Where I'm headed, there's no going back. It will be the end. And if I have to die, then I'm taking the mind down with me. It's all going to end in fire and pain and death. And I don't want people I care about getting caught in it. But that's another thing that's not up to me. You have to choose. You can stay behind, or come with me. Screw Adara, man! What does escape matter if the mind comes back anyway? I mean, I have liked you before, but now I know you. And you're one hell of a man, Connor. I'm going with you. Thank you, Warren. Eno? Maybe I won't see the rings of Azeroth and all that stuff, but saving the entire human race kind of puts that to shame. So if you think I'm going to let you face this alone, you're wrong. I'll be with you until the end. Alright, it's settled then. Let's finish this. I've got navigation. Eno, you be my pilot. 
Warren, I want you manning the laser turrets. Sounds fun! What do I have to do? Just keep an eye on our track projection and watch for hazards. Don't worry, this is going to be a real short flight. Adora's men just broke into the hangar. I'll hold them off with the belly gun. Isn't the Aeon parked right outside the hangar door? What are we going to do about it? We get past it and then use the ship's cannons to blow up the colony. That should distract them for us. I can't keep them at bay for too much longer! Let's hope Adara's mechanics did enough to get us off the deck. Activate the drive reactor. Drive reactor powering up, energy level steady, and holding. Good. Activate sublight drive. Activate. It's on but operating at minimal efficiency. It won't take us far. We don't need to go far. Is it holding? Looks like it. We go now or not at all. Alright. Take us out. They're escaping! After them! The Aeon's in pursuit! Keep steady. Let them chase us. Shoot that asteroid! Fire it! That should take care of them for now. Let's keep going. My colony! No! Follow them! The planet's dead ahead. Take us in carefully, Anno. I'm reading some pretty unstable conditions down there. Weather looks pretty rough. Get ready, this is gonna be rocky. We just lost half our power. We must have taken damage. Don't panic! I'm gonna try to put us down! Cascade failures everywhere! I can't stop them! Losing altitude! The planet's gravity is overtaking us! We don't have enough power! 